Students in one of the area's largest school districts will return to class tomorrow after the cold wiped out part of its bus fleet today. Amy Holly shows us what the KCK school district is doing to get those buses back up and running. The Kansas City, Kansas School District promises its students will finally return to class tomorrow, but not without the district overcoming some serious challenges in the last couple of days. You know, when it's cold outside, you probably go turn on your car and let it warm up. But when you've got 200 vehicles just about to start up, you're going to run into some problems, especially in the cold. Problems particularly for the bus fleet in the Kansas City, Kansas School District because the buses had sat so long over the holidays in the cold and then, of course, right before school was supposed to have started this week. The temperatures dropped to tundra-like cold. In fact, it felt like it was 17 below wind chill yesterday, which turned diesel fuel to sludge, drained batteries, and complicated the fueling process. That crippled about a quarter of its fleet. Too many downed buses for a 20,000 student population that heavily relies on bus transportation. We're the hidden heroes of, uh, you know, our educational system, and you typically don't see us. You know, we're a big part of the educational system. Without us, the kids aren't going to get there. But we are up and running now. All of our buses are ready to go. The Kansas City, Kansas School District says this is the first time in about two decades they've ever seen the sheer cold stop a good part of its bus fleet from working. So now they say that they've overcome those problems. The district says its students will return to class tomorrow. In Kansas City, Kansas, Amy Holly, 41 Action News.